guys. We're in the thick of monsoon as you can probably see by the state of the front yard around me. So I'm going out today after quite a while. That's why I'm a little extra excited about it. Do y'all remember when Nathan did the DIY sushi lunch at his beautiful home? I have a vlog of that as well. He's doing another DIY lunch at his home. Today it's going to be taco themed. Right after that, I will also be heading to quiz club which I'm going after almost two whole months which is the longest gap since I started going to quiz club so I might be a little bit rusty but I thought this would be the perfect day to vlog and bring you all along <laughs> This vlog is from the end of June so monsoon had set in since a few weeks and you can see that's when like nature really takes over and there were so many like shrubs and weeds everywhere just growing wild and the landscape completely changes during the season just the colors are so different I grabbed a ride with my friend Ira and her husband Nipun here we reach Nathan's house which looks quite different in the monsoon than it did in the warmer months. We made it here and I think everyone's pretty much gathered in the kitchen area. It's a beautiful spread out. Come let me show you all. And if you saw the previous potluck vlog, back then I was still getting to know a lot of the quiz club friends. By this time I had gone to many more quizzes and I was actually quite comfortable with a lot of the people there. So you might have seen many of these people in my other vlogs and mini vlogs but this time I was like I will properly introduce you to everyone that's there so that's our host Nathan and this is my friend Devika who actually got me into quiz club and this is Ira who gives me rides to quiz and she also has game nights at her house this is Mayur this is Ruchira I always love chit chatting with her every time we're at quiz so a lot of these people are from North Goa and I don't meet them very often because me, Nathan, Ira, we live in the south. This was our lunch spread and I was really excited about this because I absolutely love Mexican and Tex-Mex food. Ira was making our drinks so we had like tequila based cocktails. Everything was on theme okay like that was very important to us. Ira made me a drink which was delicious but it was quite strong. I wanted to cheers with somebody so Devika kindly cheers with her bottle of hot sauce and it was actually one of the most delicious fermented hot sauces I've ever tried so I'm trying to convince Devika to like start selling it because I just know it would be a huge hit. This is Nathan's mom Fatima who you must have remembered from our Benauli breakfast vlog. Food was being continuously made. I don't even know who all made many of these things like I just took ingredients and drink mixers and all and if you've not tried Mexican food I think you're really sleeping on it especially if you eat meat but it's something that can be made vegetarian as well I think it is quite similar to Indian food in the way ingredients and flavors are used but at the same time it's different enough that it's like unique to your palate a nice change my love for Mexican food is very well documented on this channel we had nachos of course there were soft and hard tacos quesadillas there was really good guacamole and refried beans and it was just a very pleasurable lunch experience and here Asta was arguing with the smart speaker because it wouldn't play the song that she wanted but it was really good music I don't remember which artist she chose but it set a beautiful vibe believe me when I say I just hogged so much at lunch like I was not shy at all there was so much delicious food in front of us that I ate and ate till I felt like I was bursting at the seams and Ira is actually a very big board gamer. Because of game nights at her place, I've learned to play so many different board games. So she brought along like a card game called Codenames and here she had set up and she was explaining the concept to everybody. But ultimately we were short for time and we couldn't play. I really love this game and I might be biased just because you know I won it many times. And you know you're like a full adult when you're at a party and towards the end people start cleaning up after themselves and it felt very very good you know. After that we took more of a tour of Nathan's house so we had seen some of it the previous time but it's a very large place. We toured the grounds and like saw more of it. That was quite nice. Yeah. 
after some more chit chatting it was time for most of us to get up and go to quiz because it was our margao monthly quiz happening we passed the raya church which is dedicated to our lady of snows that name always fascinated me because mother mary has many titles and this is just one of them but it seems counterproductive to dedicate a church in a very tropical region to our lady of the snows because it snowed in rome that's how the name came to be but it does not snow in our part of the world like at all i met this cute kitty on the way to quiz stopping at a cafe for a latte has become something of a quizzing tradition for us as well here nancy was doing a presentation on her trip to russia and this was abhijit conducting the quiz i always look forward to this chai and samosa at break time the quiz had quite a good turnout it was overall just a long but wonderful day and this was all of us heading home i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog see you all next time